Hi guys, this is Speak About Digital. In this video, I'll be comparing two popular customer relationship management tools, Pipedrive and Salesforce. Both platforms offer a distinct set of features suited to varying business needs. We will compare these to help you decide which one better suits your business needs. So, let's get started. Pipedrive is applauded for its user-friendly interface and focus on sales pipeline management. It offers tools similar to Salesforce, but is reported to be easier to use and more cost-effective, making it an attractive option for smaller businesses. Pipedrive's workflow types include updating deals, sending emails, and deal assignments. Users find Pipedrive's drag-and-drop interface to be quite intuitive. Additionally, the visual pipeline view makes it easy to track sales progress and identify potential bottlenecks. On the other hand, Salesforce is known for its vast range of features and customization options. It offers a comprehensive solution for managing customer data, sales processes, marketing efforts, and more. With Salesforce, you can easily integrate with other tools and third-party applications to create a tailored CRM system for your business. Some of its advanced features include AI-powered sales forecasting, analytics, and collaboration tools. When considering advantages and disadvantages, Pipedrive shines with its simplicity, ease of navigation, and focus on sales pipeline management. However, Salesforce, with its vast third-party integrations and comprehensive features, make a compelling case, especially for larger businesses or those requiring complex functionalities. The choice between Pipedrive and Salesforce ultimately hinges on your specific needs and budget. If you're a smaller business focused on sales pipeline management, Pipedrive might be the better fit. Conversely, if your needs are more complex and require a broader range of features and integrations, Salesforce could be your go-to option. Overall, both Pipedrive and Salesforce offer valuable services for managing customer relationships. Your decision should be guided by your specific business needs, budget, and the complexity of your operations. To get started, simply sign up using the first link provided in the video description. Thank you for considering this option. Alright, that's it for this video. I hope you found this comparison useful and learned something new. So if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up to show your appreciation. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please don't hesitate to comment below. I will do my best to respond to all comments and provide helpful answers. Thanks for watching, and take care!